Welcome back to Effortless Automation. Unlock Appium testing skills in 30 minutes. You've conducted a manual test, refined it with annotations, and now it's time to transform your efforts into a powerful Appium script. This lesson will guide you through generating an Appium script with Cobaton, marking a significant milestone in your automation journey. Generating an Appium script is a key step in automating your testing process. Cobiton simplifies this by offering script generation in various programming languages, catering to different testing frameworks. Let's create your first Appium script together. While you are in the test case page where you left off in lesson three, look for the Appium icon located in the upper right corner of the page. Clicking this icon will open the script generation modal, the gateway to creating your automation script. Inside the modal, you'll discover Cobiton supports a variety of languages and frameworks for Appium script generation, including Java with test and G and J unit, Node.js with Mocha, and C sharp with N unit. This flexibility allows you to work in an environment you're comfortable with or to explore new ones. For this example, we're selecting Java test NG. Once you've chosen your preferred language and framework, click the generate button. This will download a zip file containing your full project. Navigate to the download location on your hard drive and unzip the file. Inside, you'll find your complete project ready to be opened. Cobiton's commitment to open source means you're not limited to the languages directly supported. If you prefer working in Ruby, Python, or another language, you can contribute to or utilize the open source project on GitHub to create your own generator. Details and links can be found in the lesson notes. With your Appium script in hand, you're ready to take the next step in automation. In our upcoming lesson, we'll dive into how to open and modify your new Appium script to fit your testing needs. The power of automation is now at your fingertips. See you in the next lesson.